With their soulful eyes, obvious intelligence and expressive nature, mountain gorillas tap a fundamental sense of empathy in all of us. There's no doubt they're one of the most fantastic and majestic animals you'll ever experience. They are, after all, not unlike us. Gorillas are incredible creatures, they really are. They're like gentle giants. They're so charismatic and I guess working in the zoo, I love just standing back and seeing the impact they have on our visitors when they come in. You look, you look deep into their eyes and you know they've got a story to tell. Unfortunately, we don't have as many gorillas in this world as we should have, and unfortunately every year they're declining. It's heartbreaking. I think this is one of those species that you think, they're so charismatic, so many people care about them. If we can't save this species, I'm not sure what hope we have for all the many others that need our help. Found in the war-torn Democratic Republic of Congo, these critically endangered gorillas have been, and still are, severely affected by the mining of coltan. So Rachel, tell us a little bit about coltan mining and the sort of impact it's actually having on these guys. It's mined basically so that it can coat the capacitor in a mobile phone. It's, uh, very small amounts do make their way in, but when you're thinking about the production of one billion mobile phones every single year around the world, even the smallest amounts of coltan that come from the habitat of the gorillas can have a huge impact on this fragile ecosystem. With global technology innovation on the rise, the demand for coltan continues to surge, creating the incentive for miners and traders to step up their efforts to extract it. This frenzied rush is, of course, opening the way for poaching and the deforestation of one of the last sanctuaries of the eastern lowland gorilla. So basically when the miners move into their habitat, they, they make pathways and roads so that they can access the uh, materials. And what happens then is you expose entire populations to poaching. They were once in this pristine habitat, they were safe, they were secure, people couldn't get in. It's quite mountainous and rough. And all of a sudden we've just created these roads and people can access them. And the populations are declining really, really quickly. Zoos undoubtedly play an important role in conservation in terms of breeding programs and habitat protection. But they're also doing their bit to cut the demands of coltan. Let me be now. So why are zoos important to the gorilla? Basically we've recently launched a campaign which is a community conservation campaign. So it's driven by the community. The success of it depends on people getting involved. It's called They're Calling On You. And what the zoo is doing is actually developing a mobile phone recycling program that's actually helping to secure these species in the wild. So the idea of the program is that if Coltan's in all of our mobile phones and there are more mobile phones in Australia than there are people, then we can actually get those mobile phones and refurbish them. How much of a difference does just recycling my mobile phone make? Well, it can make quite a lot of difference because one, it means that we can actually reuse some of those metals and that means we don't have to continue to mine quite as much. The real difference really comes from the fact that we get $2 from every single mobile phone that's donated. So when they go to be refurbished, Aussie Recycling Program, our program partner, actually give us money back that we can then invest back into conservation. The money that's been raised so far from the program is going into Mako National Park in Democratic Republic of Congo. And we're actually employing rangers to increase anti-poaching efforts in situ where it really matters so we can help to secure these populations. As a mobile phone user, it's no point feeling guilty about something we didn't know about. But now we know, and surely we're bound by human decency to take action. This program's incredibly exciting because with the community support, we can make a huge difference for these species. <laughs>